put in a student confirmation email if they've purchased a course or a workshop from you, or perhaps a workshop registration of some kind. First of all, you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you have created an automation that will send that student, that buyer, confirmation of their purchase and instructions for how to access their training. Now I'm talking specifically about courses or workshops here that you would have uploaded into your courses area. So what we have here is a recommendation. I'm gonna give you a template and in the bottom of this email in the description, so in this email, at the bottom of this video in the description, I'm also gonna include a copy and paste of this uh, email of mine so that you can use this as a template for yourself. So when somebody buys one of my courses, for instance, I've got a workshop here that I've recorded and that recording is now available for sale. When somebody buys that, it's going to trigger a workflow that will include this initial email. So it will say, hi, contact first name. Now to put that first name in, put your cursor where you want the name to go, click on the custom values icon and type in, uh, click on contact first name, and you'll get this little value here that will pre-fill with that purchaser's name. You've um, success, you've now got access to the workshop blur, put the workshop name. I then tell them in one sentence what it is that they've purchased, just to remind them, so in this case, this is a two hour pre-recorded workshop or this is a three day challenge or this is a I don't know, 12 month membership, whatever it is that you've sold them so that they can just remember what it is they've got. I then have two options for them to access their training, which all of you guys can give to your students on Techmatics how to access theirs as well. So again, provided that you've uploaded this training, this workshop, this resource to your courses area, here are the fields and the instructions you're going to give them. I put how to access your workshop, login URL, I type that in first, and to get that URL, you go again up to custom values and scroll down to where you will find, oh, we're inside contacts at the moment. I'm gonna press the back arrow. So it takes us to our main menu of custom values. And I'm gonna scroll down to membership contacts. Now in Techmatics, membership contacts here means courses area. It means anything in that courses and products and memberships section. So we're gonna click on membership contacts and you're gonna click on login URL. Bump, there it is. So that code will pull up the URL to your school and the contacts login email so that when they click on that link, which will pre-fill as customized for them, it will take them to the place where they log in to your courses. Then I type in login email and this will pull over the email address that they use to purchase the course with. So again, you'll go to custom values, scroll down to membership contacts and then click on email. Boink. There you go. And that will pull in that email field and will pre-fill it with whatever email they use to log into the system. Now, when they do purchase your offer, they should be given the opportunity to create a password. <laughs> if um, they haven't or they've forgotten it, this is just a real generic instruction I give to everyone. If you don't know your password, for whatever reason, click forgot password and you'll be sent a new one. Okay, that's the best instruction you can give to people because this then automates the process of them receiving a password link and you don't have to be involved in the process and nor do any staff that you may or may not have need to be involved in the process. Then if you have any trouble, please reply to me on this email and one of us will get back to you ASAP. Now the second instruction I have for people who buy courses or products or anything from me that's in my courses, products and memberships area is the option for them to download the mobile app to watch on the go. Now if you are a Techmatics customer, your students get a free mobile app to access your courses automatically by default. So I've got here, um, it's called Collab, it's called the Collab app. Download my mobile app for free. And I'm gonna type in Collab here. Um, mm -hmm. Download my mobile app for free on Android or Apple. And I've actually just hyperlinked those with the link that takes them directly to the app store. So you'll see here that takes them straight to the Android app store. This is what the Collab app looks like. If they install that on their device and they log in using the login details to your school, your courses are gonna be in there for them. How good is that? This is the gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> Apple's exactly the same. So they've got Apple, they click on that and it will open up the Apple store where they can download the Collab app from there. And again, instruction is use the same login details to access your training from your mobile device. This is completely automatically set for you guys as Techmatics users. If you have courses on Techmatics and you have a Techmatics account, 
you have access to this app for your students to log into to access your courses already. Hope you find the training helpful, the end save template. Um, now, please note the naming convention I use, workshop, name of the workshop, and then I have registration access email. This is really important to uh, get quite strict with your naming conventions for your emails because it's going to really help you out later on when it comes to adding these to your automations and your workflows. But that there is the sort of very plain generic template that you would give somebody who signed up for any of your products or services in the courses memberships area. If you've got any questions, let us know. I hope that helps. See ya.